Hello guys, welcome back. Today I am filming a style guide for you guys. Kind of like a lookbook on how I would style all the new pieces that I got in my clothing haul um, that I posted the other day. If you haven't seen it already, I will leave the link below. But yeah, I thought it would be really fun to kind of show you guys how I piece everything together, um, how I style it with all the jewelry that I got, hair accessories that I got, hairstyles and everything like that. So. Yeah, I'm really excited to film this, but I also have no idea what I'm doing, so I'm just going to kind of wing it, so just bear with me. Um, my style is quite different to the norm, so if you don't like it, that's fine, but leave your opinions to yourself. Um, this is how I personally would style everything, and yeah, I'm really excited to try and piece outfits together, so let's go. Okay, so the first outfit I'm going to show you, I um, wore out on Saturday night and I got some photos in it yesterday. So it is these flare jeans from Glassens with this um, cropped stripy turtleneck t-shirt. I have tied this up here, um, but I think this is such a cute like 70s vibes outfit. I would then pair it just with a belt. These jeans are a little bit big. I think they've stretched already. And then some Nike Air Forces. These I bought in America. And then I'm also going to pop on my popular necklace from Dolls Kill. And then I just have my hair in little butterfly clips to pin it back a little bit. I think that looks really cute with my fringe. I got some photos in the other day. These pants are the pants from Princess Polly and then this singlet is just from Glassens, just a plain white singlet. So the first thing I would style it with is just this belt from Princess Polly as well. The shoes, I would definitely pair these with my new Air Maxes just to add that little bit of gen flare and a pop of colour. And then using my girl clips from Dolls Kill, I'm just gonna pin my hair back. So this is what my hair looks like. My fringe looks cooked. Oh, and then I would roll the bottom of these pants up. So yeah, this is the second outfit. I wanted it to be wanted it to be a little bit like punk, a little bit fun, a little bit different, um, but still super easy and chilled and laid back. So this is what it looks like. I'll make sure I insert some photos of all these outfits as well, so you can kind of see what they look like out and about. favorite outfits. This is the Motel Angel Top with these pants from Princess Polly. I think this is so, so cute. A uh, little bit of fun, a little bit of contrasting patterns, but I think it's literally adorable. So I've popped my hair in space buns just for something fun and different. I think space buns just add such a fun and playful um, element to a look. Um, so I'm going to go in and add these clips from Dolls Kill just to kind of tame down all the flyaways that I have. And then I'm also, to tie in with that, going to pop on at this really cute rainbow heart necklace. So cute. And then for shoes, I'm going to pop on my rock boots. I love these, but I never really get a chance to wear them. I love this. It's almost like a Harajuku kind of vibe. Like... Hawaii, Harajuku. I think it looks so cute, very extra. Um, would only wear it in certain areas, but I think it looks really cute, especially with these boots. I've been finding, trying to find an outfit to wear these boots with, so yeah. Definitely my favorite, let me know what you guys think. This next outfit is all from Glasson, so this is the uh, Starry top from Glassons and these are the same flare jeans that I had on before um, but obviously with a different top. We 
please ignore the um, makeup that I just got on this while I was trying to get it over my fat head. Okay, so for this outfit, I definitely want to bring back some color. So I'm going to match my hair and we're going to go with these pink star clips from Doll's Kill. And then these pink snakeskin hoops from Louisa. Cool, so that's what the clips and the earrings look like. I've kept my hair in space buns because I think it goes with the fun of the whole outfit. Very much festival vibes, but still 70s fun vibes. <laughs> vibes. And then for shoes, I'm going to pair it with my pink Nike Air Forces. whole outfit, a little bit more casual, but definitely still fun with the pops of colour. Um, I don't know where I would wear this, but I think it would be fun regardless. <laughs> I think it's cute. What do you guys think? I feel like I'm being super awkward in this video, so sorry, but I just don't really know what I'm doing. Um, but I'm liking these outfits that I'm pulling together, so yeah. This is such a cute like winter outfit, so this is actually what was on the model on Princess Polly when I bought this jumper. This is the exact outfit. Ooh, this is the exact outfit that she was wearing. So it's just these Princess Polly pants, which are so tight after a meal, ladies and gents. Um, and then this side-by-side -side jumper. I think for earrings, I'm gonna pair it with these earrings from Lavisa, even though they don't really go with the checks, but I think they'd kind of go with a really cute vibe. <laughs> that I would just pin it back in some black clips and then for my shoes I would just pop on my almost plain almost plain um, white Air Forces and that just keeps this look a little bit more classy a little bit more wearable outfit is definitely where my casual tomboy skater guy vibe comes in. This is obviously, obviously, this is honestly what I would wear on a day-to-day -day basis. An oversized t-shirt with a turtleneck underneath and just some ripped jeans. This is honestly my jam. This is what I wear day in day out. Um, these jeans have a little butt slit. Um, they're from Universal Store. I think they're, they're Ziggy jeans. Um, but yeah, this is just the modern day romantics top from Princess Polly, and this is just a white cropped um, turtleneck from General Pants. It's 2 for 40 on these turtlenecks, I have it in grey and white. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is definitely a more chill, casual vibe. Okay, I really don't know why the camera's trying to convince you that I have a massive gap in the front of my fringe, because I don't. It's actually ruining the video for me, but anyway. Um, and then, so I would just pop a little clip in with this one. I wouldn't accessorize it too much because um, when I'm going out to the shops, this is probably what I wear. What I would wear, and I wouldn't wear any jewelry with it. But if I was going out and my mom said make it more dressy, this is what I would do. So these earrings are just from Lavisa as well, and I just think they add a little bit more of a girly vibe to it instead of my. Gator Boy Avril Lavigne vibe. <laughs> Just like that. And I only clipped back half my hair because I thought it looked a bit dumb in the double clip because it kind of looks just a little bit strange. But yeah, this is what I would do with my hair and jewelry. And then for shoes, I'd probably just pop these ones on again or maybe just my like white and pink ones, but yeah. So yeah, that is what this outfit looks like. Super chill. Super casual, super me, sometimes. Sometimes I go extra, sometimes I go chill, but this is definitely what I would just wear when I'm just hanging out, you know? This is the last outfit. I'm not too sure how I feel about this, this one. This one, I think it sounded, looked a lot cooler in my head, but I don't know, I kind of like it. It's definitely um, different, but that's me anyway. Um, I think it's kind of cute. This is just a oversized Harley Davidson shirt from Glassons. This is that stripy turtleneck from Princess Polly and these are the Harvey jeans from Princess Polly as well. To accessorize, I would just pop in these snake earrings from 
Lamisa. And I think I'm just gonna wear my hair out. I don't wanna add too much to this outfit because it's already quite a lot. So that's what it looks like with the earrings and just my hair very relaxed. And again for the shoes, just because these kind of match the colors in it, I would just pop these on. And yeah, that is the outfit. Definitely, again, a little bit tomboy, skater boy. Um, I'm not sure how I feel about it. Let me guys, let me, let me know what you guys think. Um, this is definitely one that I'm unsure about. Okay guys, that is it for this video. Um, very out of my comfort zone once again, so sorry if I sounded a little bit awkward, but 2019 is the year of being fearless, ladies and gentlemen, so we're pushing ourselves out of comfort zones. Um, and that was really fun, just like my clothing haul was too. Um, yeah, let me know which one your favorite outfit was. I will definitely be doing more of these, even though I going on a shopping cleanse for a little bit um but yeah i'll definitely do one of these in the future if you guys like it so make sure you let me know let me know what your favorite outfit is check out dylan's music channel check out my instagram i don't know what else to say but i hope you enjoyed this video guys thank you so much for watching and i can't speak because it's late at night and i want to get to bed <laughs> peace out